knees spreading from the wing. You're yelling, go, go, go. Right, you're going fast. Stop, notice we filled so the we're just spot. getting started. Notice Austin stepped in and filled the bottom spot. We got the five spots again. What is Jay Avery doing fast? Taking a step. Notice the defense didn't jump to the ball. You're yelling fast. What do we have to do here? Fill. So you're in. Good. Jay Avery fill out. So we're getting started here at the second session of the day. Session three overall of the Idaho Showcase. Uh, Coach Colby Blaine is setting up the uh, the motion action that we're going to be putting in uh, throughout the day so that not only are we uh, learning concepts, but we can also use, that, use these when we do our five-on-five five stuff later on. And uh, A lot of showcases get junked up when it comes to five-on-five, five, a lot of one-on-one -on -one stuff, a lot of... Um, my time or my turn basketball and we're trying to avoid that so we put in some stuff put in some different actions uh, so that these guys will have a better opportunity to showcase what they can do later in the day and towards tomorrow and so we've had a great showing so far uh, the kids are doing an awesome job they're, they're really starting to pick up on some of these concepts and show what they can do and so uh, to this point we've we've had some great speakers uh, in addition to the games we've had off the field come in and now we're going to go through a final session of the day. So what you'll see today in, in the next few minutes you're going to see some uh, some work done uh, at the different courts uh, and then we're also going to try to show some five on five stuff later on uh, probably in about an hour or so is when we'll get to that. So stay tuned we're just going to let this run for a bit. You can watch the guys go. Uh, we'll try to do a wide shot so we can get everybody uh, here as they break up and give you a feel for how the showcase is running here in this session.
want to pass through the rim and catch a score for our curl game, right? So, it, this is a good idea to go out there. I'm screening away. You're curling. Go ahead and curl over to this one. You were going to pass that. We're curling over the top, my name is Zach. Zach. We want to throw Zach the ball. Stand up the ball. We want to throw Zach the ball to catch and score at the rim. If, if uh, Zach can get the ball, we want to throw to me at the play spot to catch and score. We don't want to throw to the action. If Zach is going over this thing, he's going to catch the ball out. He's going to the play. He's going to take a quick dribble. He's drowning or he, or he fumbles it. That's on the pass. Throw it to the rim to score. Throw it to the replace guy to catch and shoot or catch and drive. Okay, now that's just another advanced thing to think about that. Play 10 
10 total. So five fives, five fives, 10 total. You score by twos and threes on offense. Coach Andy, I will count down the, the shot clock this time. Actually, you will count down the shot clock, okay? Oh, okay. Coach Roman, here we go. Let's watch it. Let's go. Let's go.
All right, we're gonna take a little break and kind of gather our technical equipment, all that kind of stuff together, and then we're gonna try to bring some five-on-five -five, uh, full court stuff here. Probably, oh, I'd say probably in about 20, 25 minutes, we'll try to get some full court five-on-five -five, uh, live. Thanks for checking it out, and we'll be back shortly.